My name is Elizabeth Baskin and have been a longtime resident of Richmond and have known the Virginia Eye Institute. It's where I've come, where my parents came and everything for just checkups and, and so forth. I personally think that it's you've got the best group of doctors for vision care anywhere around. Um, when Mary Payton's condition was discovered, she was sent from here up to Johns Hopkins to the Wilmer Eye Institute up there. Um, and Dr. Ladd assisted in the first surgery that she had up there and then he ended up transferring down here and he has followed her ever since. The support staff is outstanding. Uh, Dr. Ladd's assistant, Karen, is wonderful. Um, and we've always gotten very quick response to any of the needs. We've had a couple of situations where Mary Payton has said something just doesn't seem right and we've been in right away and they take care of our daughter. Right now she is in surgery with Dr. Ladd for a redetachment of the retina in her left eye. Um, we discovered this uh, about two and a half weeks ago before she headed off to college through regular checkup with Dr. Ladd. The vision that she has in her left eye is minimal at best. Um, she's, it's considered legally blind even with corrected vision. She was born with a condition called microophthalmia bilateral coloboma that affects the vision in both eyes. Essentially the sphere of the eyes did not form in a seamless sphere and so the optic nerve is wrapped down into a crevice and so both eyes she has some you know, vision issues with. The, um, her right eye is stronger than the left and with correction she can see 20-25 with that. But the right eye, we just want to make sure that the limited vision that that's saved in case anything were to happen to her better eye. Um, she is 18 years old. She can drive. She's passed the test that she can drive, which is good. And she's a freshman, uh, first year student in college. My name is Elizabeth Baskin and I'm here today because my daughter Mary Peyton Baskin is having surgery and Dr. Ladd is looking after her.